this one's birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear babies. Happy birthday to you. Okay, open your present. Careful. Jeez. Baby! What? It's fine. You know, it almost had me. It said at nearly 10 inches tall, and I thought it had only one of the thingies. I was like, at nearly 10 feet tall, the dashing patron spirit of Halloween is ready to use his ghoulish guide to spare you the despair of this organization by housing your keys at his feet via the included logo keychain. You want to show the camera? All right, you want to get him out? I'm letting you know now. None of your stuff was going to get here on time for your birthday. So I got this. I literally went in to GameStop. And they had those Kingdom Heart figures. Mm -hmm. But then I saw this. And it was the only one that Andy had. And Andy talked me into it. And Andy put it up for me. And then I bought it. For your birthday. I need to have a talk with him and tell him he needs to. So here's Jack with his pumpkin and Zero. And then there's a little holder right here that has a keychain. So yeah. It's this one's birthday and this is his present. Now I'll talk to y'all once I wake up a little more. Your mom literally buy you only clothes and then chocolate strawberries. Mm, whatever. Well, Grandma got you a quilt because you sit there and ruined ours. Yeah, it's one of these. What are those? This little <gasps> that... for Christmas thing that you'd want to get me. Oh. You probably did get them. No, I didn't get these. Hmm. Let's see what they are after you see what the rest of it is. It's paint. Is it black pants? Woo! Are you sure you didn't get me this stuff? No, I did not get you this. Wow, she got a lot of them. Holy crap. I guess Andy talked her into it. And it looks like jerky. Yep. You got jerky, sexy black pants. Mind y'all guys, this boy only wears work pants and they're all ruined, so. They're not ruined. I did not know he would wear black, but he has black. Okay. First bag, she gave him four blind bags, which if y'all seen anything, I have little guys over there that are these characters. We bought, the guy at GameStop got Jack, Sally, and Zero for us because he, he knew, like, what was in what bag. Whew. What? It don't smell good inside the bag. Oh. Well, which one did you get? I got Mayor. Yay! Show Mayor. Oh, I bet, I bet you that guy was probably there and she got the rest of them. Okay, so here's Mayor. You're in the light. You're literally in the light. So here's little Mayor. He's got his little guy on him and his little face. Yeah. Oh, and there's his bad face on yeah. the other side. Yeah, just open your present. <gasps> okay. Oh, now we got shot. Next bag. Okay, so we have the little clown guy with the tearaway face. Maybe not. Might hurt yours. We're doing really good, guys. We don't have any doubles.
Last one? Meh. Damn it! We have a double! Yes. I thought I replied. We have two mares. So I said thank you. But that's you. okay. Mom, you did good. You only got one double. You only got one double. Probably. I'm not, anyway, I'm, not the one I'm gonna go ahead and uh, end this here. I just wanted to show y'all because he was opening the uh, his present from his mom, and then like I said, he got this quilt right here, this one from his grandma because our quilt's tearing apart from us manhandling it, trying to cover up. So he's got his own quilt now that's also long enough that covers his feet. So anyway, I'll talk to y'all in a little bit. Bye. Well, I haven't done this yet, but our advent calendar is number 15, and it is a mini, I believe. Yep, and it is a Pluto, and like a festive coat or something, or a present. Let's get him out of the package. Hey guys, so he's like in a festive little polka dot outfit with a bow on it and a star, and now... I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and put him in the train. Oh, look at his little tail. <laughs> so now he's in the little train. So so far, this is everyone. And then this is the one that I got in the mail for my friend Luna. So that's our whole crew right now. And then now I guess we're gonna relax. We need to do. No, we don't. Yes, we do. We, don't we need to do Christmas cards. So they can get out on time. Because I already sent them to my friends, but not like our other friends and family. Mm -hmm. So, anyway, we're probably gonna go do that and relax. So, I will catch up with y'all in a little bit. Hey guys, so it's been a little bit since I last talked to y'all. Um, we uh, went out to eat for Luke's birthday. That little clip y'all see of the food is me messing around because I got my salad because normally when we go out to this place we always get salads first, but Luke decided to get a bowl of grapes. <laughs> and uh, I just thought it was funny how there was salad, salad, and then just grapes. But we went out to eat and enjoyed that, and then um, we went to Walmart and looked at different stuff for my Secret Santa to get, and then I realized I forgot my freaking card, so it didn't do me any good. And then uh, we just came home, and uh, I've been just on my phone like I normally do, and uh, Luke was playing his games, and then we let the dog in and let him play with him and stuff, and then he went to bed. Gypsy's in bed, but um, I was going to show y'all real quick. My friend Katie sent me her letter, and it was on this cute little paper here, and she sent me a little twin star envelope with her address on it, and then she sent me, it was in this red little envelope, which I'll not show the front because it's got her address on it, but it's just in this little red envelope with washi tape. And then she sent me these three little stickers. There's this little wreath one here, and then this one that says, Baby, it's cold outside. And then this cute little flower one that says, I love you on it. And then she sent me, she went to Disneyland recently. She sent me a little Disneyland uh, pamphlet with the map in it and everything. And it was during the Christmas time and stuff, which I thought was cool. And then she sent me her Christmas card, which I got to buy new garland because mine got all tangled up when I packed it last year but it's this little twin stars one with a little wreath and it says Merry Christmas on it and then you open it up and it's got this little bear characters on it which is real cute and it says Callie hope uh, Callie have a lovely and magical holiday love Katie and then she draw little holly on it and it says Merry Christmas and then it just has little twin stars on the back with Sanrio. And it's just really, really cute. 
So right now I just have it displayed, which it's really dark in here because he's asleep. I have it displayed on our little um, new key holder that we have because it's got like little shelves on it. If y'all remember my, my either yesterday or day before's vlogmas, I showed it. Um, it's got little shelves on it, so I keep putting my hand right here and it blocks the camera. Um, but yeah, so it's thick enough or wide enough, I guess, to uh, put like little cards on it like that. So I just stuck it there for now. Um, but I got the tree it's all lit up right now and I've been just relaxing and looking on stuff and um, looking for things for my wish list and stuff for next year. I have no idea what I'm getting for Christmas at all this year. Um, if it's anything like last year, it's going to be chaos, but I'm super excited. Because um, if y'all were here with me for last year's Vlogmas, um, I did my 25th one. I did my what I got for Christmas instead of an actual Vlogmas. Because I had an actual Vlogmas of... Christmas Day, at least with my mom's family. I didn't want to, like, shove the camera in Luke's family's face and stuff and, like, ruin it because it was our first, it was the first Christmas with Luke as his girlfriend and stuff, so I just didn't want to do that. But, um, <clears throat> I, uh, found out that they do stockings and stuff, so I bought this little stocking you see over there behind my tree. I found out, sorry, I found out it was way too small for gifts that they do so they bought a bigger stocking which is with the rest of our stockings in the other room uh, and just filled it with goodies so I was not expecting any of that and then all the presents I actually got I got um if I remember correctly from this family I got a hair dryer that I asked for because I I don't like having to like wait for my hair to dry and when I do it's like all just a tangled mess which I know if I honestly took the time to uh towel dry it and like put detangler in it and all that stuff but I just I wanted a hair dryer so his mom I know bought me a hair dryer and then they bought me um little just cute bears and cupcakes and stuff like that and stuff I just don't even remember now like I can go back on my video and see all of it because I recorded it of course but um so I don't know how it's gonna go this year uh for this year, I finally had enough money to buy my parents presents, Luke a present, his mom, I have a present in mind, I, I have a present for her, and then like his grandmother and, and all the, everybody, and then my family, I have my uncles and my aunts, and my brother, and his kids, and like I just have everybody took care of, and then I'm also doing a secret Santa, so it's just chaos, and um, I just talked to my dad a few minutes ago, and he was telling me that my uncle got home finally, and uh, he went and saw him actually at his house, and he was able to talk now, and uh, that he was doing okay, and that uh, my my grandmother's home now, because she was in the hospital, my mom's mom, and so, and then I also found out that my grandmother that I thought wasn't going to have Christmas because my grandpa was sick. She's going to have Christmas because he said to not just put it off just because he was sick. That if he had a good day, the day that Christmas that we were going to have it, he was going to be having a good day. And if he didn't, he was sorry, but he didn't want to ruin Christmas just because he was sick. So I have that to look forward to. So it's as chaotic as it was last year when I went and saw my mom or I had Christmas here. And then saw my mom's family, and then saw my dad's family that night. And it's probably just going to be as much of that chaos and more. Because I might have to go see my dad and them on the 23rd, which is Saturday. Because Christmas is on a Monday this year. And have Christmas here on Monday. So Saturday with my dad. Monday with this family and probably Sunday with the rest of the family and all that so I just don't know how that's gonna go but that is my life right now literally today would be now 10 days until Christmas and I have to figure out all this before Christmas so and I 
like I said, I haven't even sent out Christmas cards, and they're probably not even going to get there now. And my dad was telling me, he's like, you know, it's a little late to be sending Christmas cards now, because they'll be getting there, like, New Year's. And I was like, yeah, you're right. I fail. <laughs> but I've been just so more worried about trying to get presents ready and wrapped and good to go to where everybody would have a present. So I don't, I don't know what we're going to do, so... I'm going to go ahead and stop rambling. i got to go to bed. i got things to do tomorrow. Y'all will see tomorrow in Vlogmas what those things will be. And I will see y'all tomorrow. Good night, guys.